everyone, welcome back. Huge spoilers for Troll Hunters Rise of the Titans. So, you have been warned. So, if you saw my reaction to the movie, I absolutely loathed, loathed the ending. The movie is fantastic. It, the movie is absolutely fantastic. The ending pretty much killed it for me. I am so mad. It didn't make any sense, and it frustrated me because nothing happened. And it also seemed like nothing mattered. But the more I'm thinking about it, that is far from the case. After doing a spoiler talk with Coolcraft on his channel, link in the description, I really found a liking to the ending. Basically, the theory is, when he reset the timeline, he still has the amulet in the new timeline. They just didn't show that. And since Toby gets the old amulet, there will be two troll hunters. Not only that, but I think that everything that happened in the original timeline was not for nothing. It was not pointless. Yes, it never happened, but Jim now has knowledge. He remembers everything about what didn't happen. He remembers everything about what happened in the original timeline that now doesn't exist, and now he can prevent any bad thing from happening. What about Strickler? Well, it's been proven before that Jim can convince Strickler to be on his side. What about Engelrod? Well, Jim will be able to wear the Infernocopula and possibly give his soul back so that Angor will be on their side. What about Otto? Well, Jim will tell Otto that Gunmar will possess him and kill him. He's basically going to bring everyone on his side and he's going to have an army. Drawl won't have to die, let alone lose an arm. Vendel won't have to die because Gunmar and possibly Userna would already be dead. The Eternal Knight won't happen because Morgana will still be in her prison. And as for the Acheridians, they will now have an army to fight General Morando alongside them. Morando might not become a god, which means Galen's core can be used for something else. Here's the kicker about this theory, Merlin, planned for this to happen. He used the time map to plan everything. He planned for Jim to reset the timeline and save everyone, which means this was supposed to happen. In Loki terms, if you've seen Loki, he is still on the sacred timeline. He is not a variant. This was supposed to happen. In the very first episode, even though both Toby and Jim went down the canal, the amulet chose Jim. The amulet in the new timeline now chose Toby because it sees into the future and knows that Toby is the best option in this timeline. Talking about Merlin again, they can wake Merlin up early so that he can help out with everything. And they won't have to go back in time because they'll know how to avoid it. They can stop the Arcane Order because they know how to defeat them. And they can possibly defeat the Arcane order before they become titans. And if the titans never happened, then Namora, Strickler, Nari, and Toby would still be alive, and Arcadia wouldn't be destroyed. And going back to Gunmar, if they killed him early, then the Heartstone would still have magic. Think about all of the good that will come out of this situation. Even if Jim's amulet is not there anymore, there can be a new one. And even if that doesn't happen, he's still a hero. And he still remembers everything about what didn't happen. The ending is thought-provoking. I no longer think it's bad. Sure, 90% of what I said in this video is pure speculation. But the speculation does make sense. If this is truly what they planned to do, then it's a pretty awesome ending, in my opinion. Nothing was pointless. Every piece of information from the previous series will be utilized in this new timeline and make everything better. I think this might be a controversial video. A actually, scratch that. I know this will be a controversial video. I mean, just judging from the Rotten Tomatoes score alone. But this is just my opinion. The movie isn't everything that I wanted it to be but it is worth the wait. Anyway, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more videos like this, click the subscribe button and click the bell icon so you can be notified for future videos. As always, keep it crispy.